before we start let consider how we can solve this question the most complex part of the function is e to the power of x so we can essentially make a substitution t equals e to the power of x then we need to find the value of dx in terms of dt using the differentiation finally we need to find lower and upper limits corresponding to the variable t using these results we can simplify this integral clear let's jump into the question substitute t equals e to the power of x differentiation with respect to x differentiation of the t value equals dt over dx differentiation of the e to the power of x value equals e to the power of x then we can cross multiply denominator value dx after that we can subject dx value as dt over e to the power of x instead of e to the power of x we can substitute t so we have dx equals dt over t now we need to change upper limit and lower limit corresponding to t variable when x equals 0 lower limit t equals e to the power of 0 then t equals 1 when x equals 1 upper limit t equals e to the power of 1 then t equals e let's jump into the question now lower limit 1 upper limit e instead of dx value we can write dt over t now we need to get integral 1 over t times t plus 1 now we can write numerator value 1 as t plus 1 to cancel out this t value we can write minus t after that we can divide numerator values from the denominator values separately then we have t plus 1 over t times t plus 1 and minus t over t times t plus 1 then we can cancel out numerator value t plus 1 for the denominator value t plus 1 and similarly numerator value t and the denominator value t then we can consider integral sign separately first one integral 1 over t second one integral 1 over t plus 1 integral 1 over t value we can write as ln modulus t integral 1 over t plus 1 value we can write as ln modulus t plus 1 finally we need to substitute upper and lower limit for these answers first one ln modulus t upper limit e minus lower limit 1 second one ln modulus t plus 1 upper limit e minus lower limit 1 ln modulus e value equals ln e because simple e is a positive value ln modulus 1 equals ln 1 because 1 is a positive value Similarly, we can write ln modulus e plus 1 as ln e plus 1 and ln modulus 2 value as just ln 2. ln 1 value equals 0. Now, we can remove the bracket and get the result ln e minus 0 minus ln e plus 1 plus ln 2. ln e minus ln e plus 1 plus ln 2 value we can write as ln e times 2 over e plus 1 then we have the final answer ln 2e over 1 plus e